Welcome. E aí, galera, beleza? Bem-vindo à nossa comunidade. Welcome to our community. Hello and welcome, guys. Uh, it is OGC here, part of the OGC community, uh, which stands for Original Gaming Culture. Uh, welcome to the channel. If you are new here and you are not subscribed yet, please take a moment to uh, click the big subscribe button and join our family. Today we're going human. Uh, this is a preview of what my swordsman looked like. Uh, 147,000 HP at level 14, and the archers, when gold, are 135,000 attack. Interesting. I don't use the gold in the video. <laughs> But I show you the gold just so that uh, I can show you the gold and say that, hey, I showed you the gold. So, um, welcome. The patch just came out earlier today. This is patch 1.2, 1.20. And uh, we're going to go test out the human race because they are insanely overpowered. That's the only thing I heard all day while I was at work. I came home and I was like, you know what? Time to hit some towers. So the setup that I'm using is uh, a lot of heroes and the heroes will pretty much carry. I did not want to wipe. It's been a long time since I played human. So my goal was to have some swordsmen die. Check out the shield that comes from Guardian Angel. And then... Uh, Yeah, see, see if I like it or not. Important to note, uh, actually, before I even point out the important to notes, these, everything from this patch is taken from League of Legends. So we have Guardian Angels, uh, which is a, a, an item from League of Legends on, on the Swordsman. The tree's got Thornmail, which is Thornmail from League of Legends. Like, it's, uh, it, it, it's crazy. If you look at that, uh, the snakeskin armor, and then you search for Warmogs, in League of Legends, identical. Literally identical. But I digress. So anyways, this is League of Legends, but a major RPG style. Um, uh, Avalon, Elena, and Virian all had their masteries changed and updated. So now if a unit gets a moral boost, uh, so archers for Avalon, Calvary for Elena, swordsman for Virian, the moral boost is actually going to be extended which is absolutely huge for Virian reducing damage uh, through his Crusader shield. Um, it, it's just massive overall. So here, um, for this siege, only three swordsmen died. Uh, humans are too overpowered. Everybody's going to switch to them. And yeah, I, I couldn't really test out the, the shields. I'm pretty happy with their performance overall when it comes to uh, attacking the, the garrison. Uh, but I didn't get what I was looking for. And to be honest, I might just have to go PvP people to, to see what I'm looking for in the game. So it didn't work out fighting a human tower. I refused to fight Lich as human. Uh, maybe if I had Zen Swordsman, but uh, if any die in the Mummy's Resum, uh, that, that sucks. So let's go try our luck on a Rockin' Tower. Maybe this one will kill more of our Swordsmen, and uh, hopefully we don't wipe. So that would be really embarrassing to just put up on YouTube. So the problem with this garrison is there are four turtles. Those took up so many spots that could have been eight more units of swordsmen uh, that we could have tested out on or some ninjas. So this should be an easy victory. As you can see, uh, the swordsmen, their moral boost just lasts forever which is uh, amazing. It, it, you can really, really notice the difference Uh, if your masteries are, are at like level 10, you can notice the difference. It's, it's pretty significant with the uh, moral boosts. So I'm thinking that I'll have to try this out for, for PvP and just focus on getting a moral chain going as soon as possible. So I'll, I, I think in order to do that, I need to incorporate some spearmen in there as well. The spearmen won't last uh, as long as the swordsmen in the fight. But if they can generate a moral chain right at the beginning, I, th I think humans will, will be able to sweep away the fight against certain opponents. Now that Lich had, has insane scorpions, um, Lich probably got the best out of uh, the, the Enlightenments, to, to be honest, um, at, at least for the, this, uh, this new segment of them. I, I think their scorpions are, are by far the, the most crazy. So... I think Elish will put up a really good fight, even if uh, humans run the, the Zen Archers. I think it's going to be really hard for them to uh, last long enough. But anyways, we did not lose a single Swordsman going up against this rock, and so we were not able to test out this shielding. Um, 
We'll try one more, and we'll go up against a Sylph Tower. Uh, we'll pick the 4800 power one and go up against that. I did try out the trees. Uh, so I tried out the... Uh, it must have been the Zen trees for the Thornmail, and I was really disappointed with it. It, it, it seemed very lackluster, not noticeable. Um, I, I was not uh, impressed with the Thornmail of the trees. And granted, my, my trees had like level 13 uh, chakra, really high HP. I was hoping it would reflect back a lot of damage. It just didn't do anything. So definitely disappointed with that. The dire trees, uh, I do, I still do want to test those out with the summon saplings. I think that would be pretty cool overall. But uh, yeah, for for now, we're we're going to go human, try out some some things. Um, I have a couple of ideas for human that I want to try out. I'm going to run it by the people that know a lot more in the the, the game. Uh, that know a lot more about the game in the house that I'm in and uh, if they don't approve of my human stuff Then I'll go back to slip for clash of fate So let's see how many swordsmen died in this siege as soon as we finish off the wall And we scooch back and no swordsman died. So again humans just too overpowered uh, It seems like Lilith is coming out with a new patch to totally fix the game every two weeks uh, so I, I imagine in two weeks humans are going to get a giant nerf um, or they might just disband the entire race. Maybe there will be no more human race at all. We will finally be extinct. Probably not. So throughout this week I'm going to keep posting some, some testing stuff uh, that I'll be doing uh, for the new patch or just information about the new patch, uh, put it into context w within the game. Uh, for right now I'll be Focusing mostly on human because I, I, I do think that they got a giant buff between Avalon, Viri, and, and Elena with the moral. Absolutely massive buff. Uh, their swordsmen, uh, I'll have to try out the uh, dire swordsmen in PvP to see if, if they are viable. But uh, yeah, please smash the, the, the like button, subscribe to the channel if you have not already, see more awesome Art of Conquest content. Turn on the bell notifications if you've already subscribed. And with that, I hope that the OGC family has a wonderful day. Take care, guys.